What a drill, smack bang in the middle of this fight. Smack bang in the middle of a National Marine Park. And while they tell us that, oh, you know, we've, we've mitigated the risk, we've lowered the risk, any risk at all which will jeopardise not only our environment, but our social wellbeing for communities all up and down the Southern Ocean and for the economies, for all of us here, it is not good enough. Equinor say it's absolutely safe, they can't say that. Nothing's absolutely safe. It only need one thing to go wrong and then we've got to deal with the, the consequences. It's just not good enough. Australia's you know, a smart, rich country. We should be doing better than this. In a worst case spill, it won't get to Burley. So all these people are here because they care for other parts of the coast. That makes you proud as a surfer. What we want to say in what goes on. The community is making a voice, they're making a noise. This one's not only just about surfing community, this is about uh, Australia's coastline, Australia's youth. If an oil spill happened, you know, to the extent of, of what they're proclaiming, it ruins half of Australia's coastline. And that right there is truly saddening. Take that risk just for money, and it's not even Australian money. Yeah, it truly sucks. If there is an oil spill, it won't drift up here, but if they get rights to drill in the bite, a whale sanctuary, if an oil company from overseas can get the rights to drill there, nowhere's safe. This is about us standing up and demanding our government change their systems and their processes. We need systematic change to ensure that we live a better future and that we leave a legacy for all these kids here today that we can all be proud of. Yeah.